Welcome to a journey through the cosmos. Imagine yourself a celestial voyager, exploring the vast expanse of space, witnessing the grandeur of cosmic collisions. Ever wondered how these collisions shape the universe, how they create new stars, birth planets and sculpt galaxies? Our universe is a cosmic ballet, a dance of energy and matter that has been choreographed over billions of years. As we traverse through this cosmic dance, we'll be counting down the top 10 universe-shaping events. From the dramatic death dance of stars to the cataclysmic clash of galaxies and the destructive descent of asteroids, each collision has its unique signature and each has left an indelible mark on the canvas of the cosmos. So, strap yourself in, space travellers, as we embark on this extraordinary journey. You won't believe what's at number one. Our cosmic journey begins now. Have you ever wondered how cosmic collisions have shaped the universe we live in today? Our cosmos is an ever-evolving tapestry of energy and matter, and collisions play a vital role in this grand spectacle. They are the celestial ballet of the universe, where galaxies, stars and asteroids dance, intertwine and sometimes collide. These cosmic collisions aren't just spectacular shows of nature's power, they forge new stars, birth planets and even sculpt entire galaxies. From the cataclysmic clash of galaxies to the dramatic death dance of stars and the destructive descent of asteroids, each collision imprints its unique signature on the canvas of the cosmos. These cosmic encounters don't just shape the physical structure of the universe, but also influence its dynamics setting the stage for the creation and destruction of celestial bodies. So buckle up, space travellers. Prepare to journey through time and space as we count down the top 10 most impactful cosmic collisions. At number 10, we have the Dance of the Dwarf Galaxies. In the Grand Cosmic Ballroom, two dwarf galaxies, Sagittarius and the Large Magellanic Cloud, have been performing a celestial waltz. These smaller galaxies, with their billions of stars, have been gravitationally interacting for billions of years. Their dance is not one of elegance, but of power and chaos. You see, in this cosmic dance, the partners do not twirl around each other in harmony. Instead, they pull and tug, distorting each other's structures, eventually merging into one. This cataclysmic collision has profoundly influenced the Milky Way, our home galaxy. The gravitational ripples from this merger have sent waves of stars streaming across the sky, contributing to the complex structure and dynamic nature of the Milky Way. So, while the dance of the dwarf galaxies may seem distant and detached from our existence, it's vital to remember that we are, in many ways, products of this cosmic choreography. This cosmic tango has left a lasting mark on our galaxy. Our next collision at number nine is yet to happen, but it's a big one. Now, imagine two colossal galaxies, our very own Milky Way and the neighbouring Andromeda, spiralling towards each other in a cosmic dance of gravitational attraction. That's right, folks, we're talking about a future collision on a galactic scale. Now, don't panic. This celestial event is predicted to occur in about four billion years from now. Yes, billion with a B. So we've got some time to prepare. But what will this cosmic collision look like and what would it mean for our galaxy? Well... Galaxies are mostly empty space, so it's not like two cars crashing head-on. Instead, it's more like an intricate ballet where stars, gas and dust swirl around each other, creating new patterns in the sky. The gravitational forces at play will cause our galaxies to distort and reshape, forming a new, larger, elliptical galaxy. But what about our solar system? Well, the odds of any star directly hitting another are astronomically low. So it's likely that our solar system will remain largely unscathed, although potentially relocated to a different part of the new galaxy. So while the Andromeda-Milky Way collision might sound like a catastrophic event, it's actually a natural part of the cosmic cycle. It's an event of creation, not destruction. An event that will reshape our night sky, creating a new spectacular cosmic vista. In about four billion years, we're in for quite a show. Number eight takes us closer to home, to the formation of our very own moon. Now, imagine a celestial body about the size of Mars, hurtling through space. This cosmic traveller, often referred to as Theia, was on a collision course with a young, molten Earth over four and a half billion years ago. The impact was far from gentle. 
Theia crashed into our planet with such force that a sizable chunk of Earth was ejected into space. This debris, composed of parts of Earth's mantle and Theia's remnants, didn't just drift away into the cosmos. Instead, it began to orbit our home planet, gradually coalescing under its own gravitational pull. Over time, this orbiting mass of rock and dust molded itself into a familiar shape, the Moon. This wasn't just a spectacular celestial event, it set the stage for life as we know it. The Moon's gravitational influence helped stabilize Earth's axial tilt, giving us predictable seasons and a more stable climate. Moreover, the tidal forces exerted by the Moon have likely played a crucial role in the evolution of life. These forces create the rhythm of the tides, a rhythm that early life forms may have used to transition from water to land. Without this impactful event, life as we know it might not exist. The formation of the Moon is a testament to the dramatic yet essential role of cosmic collisions in shaping our universe. Collision number seven brings us the tumultuous asteroid belt. This chaotic region, sandwiched between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter, is a testament to the power of cosmic collisions. It's like a cosmic jigsaw puzzle, with myriad pieces constantly crashing into each other. The formation and evolution of the asteroid belt are largely due to these cosmic collisions. Imagine this, billions of years ago, a planetary embryo tried to form in this region, but the powerful gravitational pull of nearby Jupiter shredded it apart. The remnants of this failed planet were set adrift, colliding with each other, breaking apart and reforming. Over time, these fragments have become the asteroid belt we know today. These collisions are not just a thing of the past. They continue to shape the asteroid belt and, by extension, our solar system. Each collision sends asteroids spinning off in new directions, some even hurtling towards Earth. So the asteroid belt, a cosmic demolition derby, continues to shape our solar system. Our sixth collision takes us to the heart of star clusters. In the grand tapestry of the cosmos, star clusters are awe-inspiring splashes of light and colour. But have you ever wondered how these magnificent gatherings of stars come to be? It all starts with a cosmic collision. Imagine colossal gas clouds drifting through the vast expanse of space. Now, these aren't just wisps of gas. We're talking about clouds with masses millions of times that of our sun. As these clouds wander, they occasionally cross paths. And when they do, the stage is set for a stellar spectacle. The immense gravitational pull of these gas clouds draws them together. As they collide, they compress, sparking a chain reaction that gives birth to a star. But this isn't a solitary event. The compression of the gas cloud triggers a cascade of star formation, like a celestial domino effect. This chain reaction can lead to the creation of hundreds, thousands, even millions of stars, all born from the same parent cloud. These newborn stars are bound together by gravity, forming what we call a star cluster. But why are star clusters important? Well, they're like cosmic laboratories. They provide unique environments for stars to form and evolve. And by studying them, we can gain invaluable insights into the life cycles of stars and the evolution of galaxies. These glittering gatherings of stars are the result of cosmic collisions on an immense scale. We're halfway through our list. At number five, we have the birth of our solar system. In the vast, infinite cosmos, a particular event of cosmic collision deserves our attention. The birth of our very own solar system. It all began with a solar nebula, a cloud of interstellar dust and gas. This nebula, enormous and dense, began to collapse under its own gravitational pull. As it collapsed, it started to spin, and as it spun, the centre grew hotter and denser, forming our sun. But what about the planets? That's where the theory of accretion steps into the cosmic spotlight. Tiny dust grains within the nebula started sticking together, colliding and growing larger over time. These tiny specks of dust grew into planetesimals and eventually into the planets we know today. It's a process akin to rolling a snowball down a hill. It starts off small, but as it rolls, it picks up more snow, growing larger and larger, until it's a full-fledged snowman. Similarly, our planets formed from the constant collision and combination of dust and rocks, each collision contributing to the building blocks of our solar system. It's humbling to think about, isn't it? From a cloud of dust and gas, through a series of cosmic collisions and accretions, 
The familiar celestial bodies we see in our night sky were formed. From a swirling cloud of dust and gas, our home system was born. Next up, at number four, we have the formation of the fascinating planetary rings. These celestial belts of dust and debris, like those encircling Saturn and Uranus, are a testament to the grandeur of cosmic collisions. Let's delve into the theory behind their formation. Picture a time when our solar system was young and chaotic. Planets and their moons were like dancers, swirling and twirling in an unpredictable ballet. Occasionally, these celestial dancers would collide. Now imagine a moon straying too close to its planet, trapped by the gravitational pull. The planet's tidal forces would rip the moon apart, scattering its remains into space. Over time, these fragments, caught in the planet's gravitational field, would orbit and form what we now see as planetary rings. These rings are not just simple bands of matter. They are intricate cosmic records of a violent past, constantly changing and evolving. These majestic rings are cosmic beauty born from chaos. Collision number three takes us back to Earth, to an event that changed the course of life. 65 million years ago, our planet bore witness to a cataclysmic event, a cosmic collision that spelled doom for the dinosaurs. A rogue asteroid roughly six miles wide hurtled through the vacuum of space before slamming into what is now the Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico. The sheer force of this impact was staggering, equivalent to a billion Hiroshima bombs. It sent shockwaves rippling across the globe, triggering tsunamis, wildfires and a nuclear winter effect. The skies darkened with dust and debris, blocking sunlight for months, if not years. This drastic drop in temperature and light wiped out around 75% of all species, including the dominant dinosaurs. Yet in the wake of this mass extinction, survivors found themselves in a radically altered world. With the dinosaurs out of the picture, mammals, which had been minor players in the game of life, seized the opportunity to evolve and diversify. Over millions of years, they filled the niches left vacant by the dinosaurs, eventually giving rise to the vast array of species we see today, including us, humans. This catastrophic collision was a game-changer for life on Earth. It closed one chapter of our planet's history, but in doing so, it opened a new one, a testament to the resilience of life and the ever-changing nature of our cosmic environment. At number two, we have the most significant collision of all, the Big Bang. The Big Bang is not simply a collision, but a cataclysmic event that marked the inception of the universe. It's an explosion of inconceivable magnitude that occurred around 13.8 billion years ago. Imagine a hot, dense point smaller than an atomic particle. This singularity was so incredibly compact, so unbelievably hot, that it contained all the energy that would ever exist in our universe. Then, in less than a blink of an eye, this point expanded. It was not an explosion in the traditional sense, but an expansion of space itself, stretching out faster than the speed of light. The Big Bang theory, as it's known, is the prevailing cosmological model for the observable universe. It describes how our universe expanded from a very high density and high temperature state. It's a theory that has been supported by a multitude of scientific evidence from the redshift of distant galaxies to the cosmic microwave background radiation. In the moments following the Big Bang, the universe was a hot, dense sea of particles. As it expanded, it cooled. After a few minutes, protons and neutrons began to combine into hydrogen and helium nuclei. Hundreds of thousands of years later, these atomic nuclei captured electrons to become full-fledged atoms. This allowed light to travel freely for the first time, illuminating the universe. As the universe continued to expand and cool, regions of slightly higher density began to collapse under their own gravity, forming the first stars and galaxies. The light from these first celestial objects is still traveling to us today, a faint echo of our universe's violent birth. The Big Bang is a testament to the power of scientific inquiry. It's a theory that has stood up to rigorous testing and scrutiny, and it forms the cornerstone of our understanding of the universe's origins. It's a reminder that our universe began in a state of unimaginable heat and density and has been expanding and cooling ever since. This ultimate cosmic collision gave birth to the universe we know today. And finally, at number one, we have the mystery of dark matter. 
Dark matter, the enigmatic substance that forms approximately 85% of the universe's mass, is a cosmic puzzle of epic proportions. It neither emits nor interacts with light or any form of electromagnetic radiation for that matter. This characteristic, while making it incredibly difficult to detect directly, doesn't stop it from making its presence known. The gravitational effects it exerts on visible matter, on galaxies and even on the universe as a whole provide indirect evidence of its existence. Now imagine this elusive invisible matter colliding. It's a bit like trying to envision ghosts boxing, isn't it? Yet these collisions, as intangible and unseeable as they may be, could potentially be one of the most influential cosmic events shaping our universe. The theory of dark matter collisions, also known as self-interactions, proposes that dark matter particles can interact with each other, not just through gravity, but also through other forces. These interactions could potentially affect the distribution and density of dark matter in galaxies, influencing their structures and dynamics. But why is this important? Well, understanding how dark matter self-interacts could hold the key to solving the dark matter conundrum. It could shed light on the nature of this mysterious substance. Is it made up of undiscovered subatomic particles? Or is it something entirely different? Something we've yet to even conceive? Moreover, understanding dark matter collisions could also help us understand the evolution and fate of the universe. After all, if dark matter plays such a pivotal role in shaping galaxies, then its interactions could very well delineate the destiny of the cosmos. The elusive dark matter through its unseen collisions may be the key to understanding our universe. Its mysteries are a testament to the vastness of what we don't know, a siren call to all those driven by curiosity and the thirst for knowledge. The universe, in its silent majesty, continues to captivate us, inviting us to solve its mysteries, dark matter being one of the most tantalizing among them. From the dance of galaxies to the enigma of dark matter, Cosmic collisions shape the universe in ways we're only beginning to understand. We've journeyed through the top 10 cosmic collisions that have had a significant hand in sculpting the universe as we know it today. We've witnessed the formation of the moon through a catastrophic impact, the creation of star clusters from colossal stellar crashes, and even the birth of our very own solar system. We delved into the mystery of dark matter, an enigma that continues to puzzle scientists. We explored the anticipated future collision between Andromeda and the Milky Way. Each of these phenomenal events, from the formation of planetary rings to the impact that ended the dinosaurs, underlines the dynamic nature of our universe. In the grand dance of the cosmos, collisions are not just destruction, but creation. As we continue to explore, who knows what other cosmic impacts we'll discover? Here, as we draw to a close on this cosmic exploration, we encourage you to join our ever-growing community. Should this journey through the cosmos have taught you something new and sparked your interest, don't hesitate to express your support by giving this video a like. We value your thoughts and theories, so share your insights in the comments section below. How do you feel about these cosmic collisions? Do you harbour any theories or burning questions about the universe and its many mysteries? We are eager to hear from you. Also ensure that you subscribe to our channel and press the notification bell to stay updated on our latest content. By doing so, you'll be among the first to join us as we unravel the enigmas of the cosmos in future videos. Remember, every new discovery and original theory brings us one step nearer to comprehending the splendid universe we call home. In this vast cosmic ballet, we are all explorers. Let's continue this exploration together. Until we meet again, keep your eyes on the stars and your curiosity peaked. After all, the universe is a treasure trove of surprises. Let's not forget to share this video with your friends and family. They too might revel in this celestial adventure.